Are you looking to strengthen your knees, your hips, your abdominal muscles, but we're experiencing some joint sensitivity? Well, today's class is just for you. Hey friends, it's Kate here. Thanks so much for joining me today. Now, recently one of my students told me she has been experiencing quite a bit of joint sensitivity, making it hard for her to do a regular Pilates class. There is no reason that we can't continue to strengthen our body or to do our Pilates from a chair. This is a 10 minute class that is meant for all levels. And when I am feeling a little tight or a little sensitive, sensitive through my knees and my hips, getting on and off the mat doesn't feel great. This class though, this little sequence, is a perfect way to continue to stretch and strengthen your body while being a little kinder to those very important and delicate joints of ours. No props are needed whatsoever, just find a chair, take a seat, let's get started. Just find a seat near the front edge of your chair. I really don't want us to be too far back because that does not help our posture out. Instead, we wanna be right at the front edge, feet about hip distance apart, hands to your thighs. Roll the shoulders back, lift your ears a little higher, wrap the tummy in. Whenever I'm thinking about my abdominal muscles working, I envision there's a belt around the small of my waist that's constantly getting one notch tighter. It's not about making myself smaller, it's activating all of the muscles around the core, helping to support me and lift up and out of my waist. Take a nice big inhale, reach your hands high. Rotate the pinkies in, grow an inch taller. Take your hands behind your head, elbows open wide. Full big inhale. Exhale, a little twist right. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, a little twist left. Inhale, look forward. Now drop your right elbow down. Lift your left elbow high. Really push my elbow up to the sky. Enjoy that lovely side body stretch. Now from here, gently forward fold. Wrap your elbows towards one another. Tuck the chin a little closer to the chest. And then restock the spine. Every little vertebrae lifts up. Take a breath. Big stretch over to the other side. Push your elbow high. Press your right hip down. Take a big inhale. Great big forward fold. Wing the elbows together. Roll yourself up. Push them nice and wide. Reach both hands high. Give them a wiggle. Take your hands down to the sides. Now we're going to keep our hands up and lifted. If this feels too much in our arms, it's okay. What I don't want to happen are little chicken arms. Reach the fingertips further away. Press down into an imaginary table. Take a big, deep inhale. As you exhale, I want you to pick up your right knee. Hold there for a second. What happened in your hips? Did you shift to one side? Did you lift your left tushy up? Can you press the butt down? Set your right foot on the ground. Exhale, pick up the left leg. Set it down. Now we're simply going to lift and lower each leg just like that. Now, of course, our hips are getting some work. Our thighs are getting some work. But I want you to think about your core holding you steady. That belt is still wrapped around your tummy. We feel our abdominal muscles working nice and hard to keep our posture open. Beautiful. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift inhale lower now maybe we just continue to do the legs if that's enough in our head that's absolutely fine if we have a little more mental space we're going to pull the thumbs together as we lift our knee open them out exhale pull in inhale open out exhale pull in open out exhale lift and release let's do two more last one Hold there for just a second. Sit up taller and straighter. Reach the fingertips high. Again, hands behind your head, elbows nice and wide. Now lift up your right leg. Take a big inhale. Twist to the right. Look forward. Set the foot down. Exhale, pick up your left leg. Take a big inhale. Twist to your left. Look forward. Set it down. Lift. Twist. Look forward, return. Now as we do this little motion, notice if you have rocked off your sitting bones. Does it feel like we've leaned behind us? Can you keep lifting up and out of the waist? Now my friend, if you don't lift your leg up as high as I do, and if you don't twist as deeply as I do, that's okay. Also, if you go bigger than me, that's okay too. It's really about just moving your body at this pace 
that works good for you. Finding your own range of motion up, exhale, twist, look forward, bring it down. Let's do one more to each side, just like this. Lift, twist, look forward, down. Now we're gonna do all of that together. Exhale, twist and lift. Inhale, return. Exhale, twist and lift. Inhale, return. Twist and lift. Let it go. Twist and lift. Let it go. Cinch the waist. Return. Cinch the waist. Grow longer out of your spine. Exhale, abdominal muscles work. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, pick it up. Beautiful. One more set just like that. Last time. Now hold there for a moment. We're gonna continue that, but take it a little bit deeper. This time as I twist, rather than keeping my chest lifted, I'm actually going to reach, not my elbow. I want you to think about your shoulder reaching towards the knee. I say the shoulder because a lot of times if I tell everyone to do their knee uh, or their elbow, you're just gonna whack that elbow down without thinking about your abdominal muscles. It's a little harder to bring the shoulder to the knee. So instead, it's a little twist and curl, let it go. Twist and curl, let it go. Cinch the waist, bring it down. Turn your tummy muscles on, bring it down. Exhale, twist and down, exhale, twist, and down. You got it, lift and lower, lift and lower. I'm saying that in the opposite direction. I guess not, I am lifting the leg. Beautiful, think punch to the gut, pull it up, punch to the gut, pull it up. Let's do two more. Last set. Last one, pause, sit up tall and straight, reach your hands up over your head, give them a wiggle, drop your right hand down, lift up, take a nice big stretch over to the side, pull both hands high, drop the other hand down, big stretch over to the side, both hands up, flip the palms, push them down. Now from here, again, I'm gonna sit up tall and straight and just reach my right leg out in front of you. I really want you to think about flexing the foot, belly button in, hands could be at our hips, or again, if we wanna work on our upper body a little bit, take your hands off to the side. Pretend there's a table there, push down on the table, take a big inhale. Now this time, instead of just picking up the knee, I want you to pick up the whole leg bring it down. Now, if when we're lifting our leg to lift it up as high as mine, you have to sink back and come up, sink back and come up. I would rather you barely lift it off the floor and keep your spine straight. So it's okay if we don't pick the leg up as high as I do. Exhale, lift, inhale, lower, press down into your left foot on the floor. Think about stabilizing through the left leg. Three more up, and down, up, and down. Last one up, hold it right there. Can you lift a little higher out of your waist? Can you wrap the tummy muscles in? Flex the foot deeper, take a big, deep, full inhale. Set that foot on the floor. Extend your opposite leg out in front of you. Give it another flex, reach your fingertips further away. Great big inhale. Exhale, pick it up, drop it down. Exhale, lift, and lower. As we lift, and lower, again, reach the fingertips further away. Wrap the ribs towards one another. Cinch your waist deeper. Beautiful. Exhale up, inhale down. Exhale up, inhale down. We lift and lower, lift and lower. For three and two, one hold, think about squeezing the inner thighs towards one another, reaching your fingertips further away, lifting your ears a little higher, take a breath, set the foot on the floor, both hands reach high, hands behind the head, elbows wide, take a twist right, twist left, hands up, bring them down by the side once more. Now again, we're gonna take our right foot out in front of us, navel to spine, chest open, and this time, lift, bring the hands together, slide it on open. Exhale, pull it in, 
reach it open. Now, if it feels too much to take the arms with us, of course, just keep them off to the side or bring them down to your hips. That's perfectly fine. Beautiful. Three, two, one, hold right here. Now, I'm gonna challenge you to keep your leg lifted if that is too much. You set the leg on the floor and that is perfectly fine. If we can keep it lifted, low belly in, chest nice and open, regardless of where your leg is, take a big inhale, take a little twist to the right. Look forward again. Twist to your right. Look forward again. Exhale, big twist. Return. Exhale, big twist. Return. Last one, big twist. Look forward, pause. Foot down, slide it in. Take your hands off to the side. Extend your left leg long. Sit up and out of the waist. Big inhale. Exhale, lift and lower. Lift and lower. Cinch your waist. Drop it down. Reach your ears higher. You got it. Is there tension in your shoulders and your chest? Shake it out, smile, you love it. This time lift up, pause. Again, bring the hands towards one another. If we wanna set our foot on the floor, that's perfectly fine. If we can keep it lifted, that's awesome too. Take a big inhale, twist to your left, look forward. Exhale, twist to the left, look forward. Cinch and twist, bring it back. Cinch and twist, bring it back for three and two, last one, hold, set the foot down, relax, walk your feet a little bit wider than your hips, take your hands high, reach the fingertips up, hands behind the head, elbows nice and wide, full big inhale, little stretch to your right, bring it on up little stretch to the left. Bring it on up. Both hands reach high, wiggle out the fingers. Take your right hand down to your right thigh and stretch your left hand higher. Maybe we keep reaching up to the sky. Maybe you take it up and overhead. Think about stacking the shoulders, opening up across your body. Full big breath. Come on up right. Both hands reach high. Drop your left hand down onto your left thigh, stretch up to the sky, and then begin to melt over your body. Stack the shoulders, navel to spine, grow out of the waist. Pull yourself right back up and bring the legs together. As always, my friends, give yourself a pat on the back. Thank yourself for doing something so good and just for you. I certainly hope you enjoyed class. I cannot wait to see you again.